Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around the 12th. So around the 12th, but keep in mind the timing is fluid, and I'm just going to explain to you really quick what I mean by that. What I mean is that there are no clocks. These readings will play out when they're supposed to. I had a comment the other day from somebody on, uh, I think it was a Virgo reading for July. This hasn't happened yet. Well, for one, that reading might not be for you. It doesn't have your name on it. Um, this reading might not be for you. It doesn't have your name on it. It may. It may or may not. It may play out next month. We're all at different levels on our journey. Okay, this is what is coming. Um perhaps perhaps okay so the daily vibes are a daily energy that is coming in for the collective okay so this means that it could be for you for someone you know somebody that you are very tight with you know that kind of thing okay but the timing is fluid we don't get to choose okay the universe chooses when things happen when we're ready or when it's meant to happen for us this is what I see coming in. We get a lot of people that are just, are new, are new to spirituality, okay? So they don't get it. They don't understand, okay? They don't understand the timing about divine timing. They don't understand that uh, there is no such thing as coincidences either. So I'm giving you this little spiel as we're talking about divine timing, so this message is going to have something to do with divine timing. Perhaps it's time. Perhaps it's time for something to happen. You've been waiting and waiting and waiting. It hasn't happened. And you've been waiting for it. So you're probably thinking, you know what, it's never going to happen. Well, maybe it's time. Okay. Uh, maybe you need to wait a little bit longer. Let's see what comes up. I think we're going to do a live tonight over on my other channel um, I might get set up after this what kind of message do I have for today interesting interesting because I was I was picking up decks to see what deck I was going to use for the daily this was like my fourth deck that I picked up and I picked it up, and this was the card that I saw. And I said, "Oh, that's that's the deck. Interesting. I cut it usually to sit. To, I usually cut it to a card to see if that's the deck that I want to use. And I cut it to this one. And I said, "Oh, well, that's the." So for some reason, we have the devil here. Um, the devil is unhealthy, toxic, materialism. Somebody that is self-indulgent, obsessed. We have two people that are tied together. They are bound to each other in an unhealthy manner. Okay. Um, this could be a sexual addiction. It could be an obsession. Okay, this is an obsession. That's what I just heard. This is an obsession. Somebody is obsessed. We have we have somebody here that is obsessed. They've they've been they've went down the wrong path. Okay. They 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 succumbed to some sort of temptation. Somebody did, and now they're now they're bound. Now they're bound to another individual, and they haven't severed the ties yet. This is very toxic and unhealthy behavior as well. Somebody is behaving in a very unhealthy manner. Okay, they are um, very unhealthy. Ah, uh, that's hell. Okay, it's hell. Somebody is putting themselves through hell. When it started, it was wonderful. It was wonderful, but it's not so wonderful anymore. Now now these people are trapped. It was a trap anyway. It was a trap from the very beginning. Somebody let their ego get in the way as well, because this is a card of ego. Interesting. Uh, bound to an unhealthy situation. Hmm... Now, the star reversed is why, 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 and it could be the masculine, because you notice we have the masculine here and the feminine here, and I just covered up this side. You never know what's going to happen. You may, we may have somebody that is saying, why, 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 why is this happening? Because this is why, why, why. This person, uh, somebody is saying why, it could be the feminine, but 
because this is a feminine here on this card, but this is why is this happening? This isn't going in the right direction. Uh, this is, I wonder, it feels like we have a fallen angel or something here, perhaps, could be. Um, this is somebody that is not very enlightened, very, very depressed. There could be some illness here. We have definitely have a lot of arrogance. Um, this is feeling ashamed. Um, this is, uh, this is, uh, feeling depleted. We definitely have an individual here that isn't very spiritual. Interesting. Not very spiritual. They've, they've succumbed to society's pressures as well. So this isn't somebody who's very spiritual at all. Um, and they're going, this is like the star reverse is losing hope. We have somebody here that is losing hope and they're losing hope because they're not very awakened. You know, they don't realize, they don't. And this is about divine timing as well. But anyway, uh, and everything happens for a reason, okay? This is obsession. We have somebody here that is obsessed with holding on to something. Uh, I don't know if we're dealing with a Capricorn. We could be dealing with a Capricorn. We could be dealing with an Aquarius, but we don't have to be. Um, hmm. Somebody's not telling the truth. There's a loss of power, lack of clarity, a lack of communication. Uh, let's just get some more cards and then I'm going to, I just want to lay out these cards first. Um, abandonment, foolish mistake, foolish, foolish pride, um, reckless behavior. Definitely have some reckless behavior here. And somebody, something could happen. Somebody could fall. Okay, they could fall. They could get hurt. Um, and then, you know, th that's why, that's why somebody is, and this could be, whatever this devil is, this could be addictions, it could be drugs, okay, Wh whatever it is, there is some sort of, uh, sadness over, uh, being left behind. Somebody's being left behind as well. There's a lack of communication. There's been some lies anyway. There has been. Somebody made a foolish mistake. They they moved too fast into something. They jumped. They they leaped. They leapt. They they jumped because it felt so good. This 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 felt so good. Okay, it felt so good. They they did it without thinking. Somebody bound themselves to another person without giving it time. Without giving it time. Okay. Anyhow. The Six of Cups reverse is freedom from obligation, packing up, leaving home. Maybe it's this person on this side, you know, letting go of the past, maybe getting into another commitment, um, celebrating freedom, perhaps, but celebrating happiness, getting moving into a new home. Somebody may be doing that, but this is a celebration um, of of happiness. This is a this is a happy celebration, a happy get together. Um, but this is, uh, this is, this is moving away from the past. Somebody has been clinging to the past, probably clinging, cl clinging to a past relationship. So the person on this side has been clinging to a past relationship and that's why, you know, they got, they may have needed an ego boost because that's what the devil does, brings an ego boost. This person on this side is saying, why, why, why is this happening? You know, they made a mistake. Somebody was stupid. They made it, and they may feel ashamed. Somebody is feeling ashamed for, you know, going down this path. Which is interesting. Now, this five of pentacles reversed is uh, coming out of the darkness. Something coming out of the darkness. There's light at the end of the tunnel here. Improvements. There's going to be some improvements. We've definitely had an unhealthy relationship with these two cards. It was unhealthy. It was an unhealthy bond. We have somebody here that definitely acted impulsively. They took a chance and they, they moved too fast. It wasn't the right time. This is bad timing. They didn't give it time. They leapt. They did it without thinking. They definitely, somebody didn't think. They didn't think. They leapt into something without thinking. And this is like a fall, falling right on their face. 
okay? Now, this could be illness, the star reversed, okay? When you do things without thinking, it can bring about illness. This could be total ruin, you know. Uh, now, the devil is, is, is a disaster. It is a disaster. It's a disaster waiting to happen, okay? It feels really good in the beginning, and it slowly deteriorates, okay? So something has been deteriorating and deteriorating and deteriorating. Now we've reached the point of total ruin, okay? There could be some disgrace here as well. We could have an individual that is very ashamed or embarrassed because of their mistake, okay? Um, hmm. Ooh, Knight of Swords reversed. Now the Knight of, or upright, not reversed. Knight of Swords is a sudden arrival or a sudden departure. Something coming in really fast. This person um, is very blunt, very direct. Somebody coming in. This person is moving very, very fast in a hurry. They're in a hurry. This is foolish. Somebody is moving very, 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 and they did move fast. That's what happened. That is what happened. But we want to talk about what is going to happen. So somebody is going to be tempted. They are going to be tempted. Probably by somebody from their past. This person may uh, not have been communicating. Maybe they feel stupid or they feel like they made a foolish mistake or, you know, now they're coming in really, really, really fast. So that is tempted. Somebody, This is temptation. Somebody is going to be tempted. Okay, we're talking about what is coming. This is temptation. Okay, it could be even a sexual temptation. Okay, so it doesn't have to be, but this is materialistic. It's lust. It's greed. It's selfish. It's ego. Somebody is going to be tempted, and uh, I don't think it looks good. Okay, they're going to be tempted from with somebody that they've dealt with in the past, somebody that they were happy with, or they had a, you know, they got together with this person in the past. Somebody is going to be tempted with somebody that they got together with in the past, okay? Um, there hasn't been any communication. This person, um, there may have been a misunderstanding or something. This is lack of judgment. Somebody had poor judgment. And they may be, they've been wallowing or something like that. This is no faith. This is fear as well. So we have some fear here. This is fear as well. In reversed. So we have some fear. We have somebody here that is fearful. They're fearful. But this is this is having no fear. So it feels like we have an individual that is going to be finding their uh, ability to let go of the fear by the looks of things. This is somebody that... Uh, is very sharp, very um, smart, very direct, very assertive. Um, is in a hurry. This person is in a hurry. So this guy has a new, just taking a new approach. He has a new idea, and he's making a move. So somebody is making a move, and they're in a hurry. The, I, I feel like whoever this person is, um, you do de definitely need to be careful. You need to be careful. Somebody is coming in very, very, very fast. He's on a mission. This person is on a mission. And it could just be for one thing, okay? Just got to be honest with you here. This person is on a mission. Um, hmm. Got some sort of agenda has a strategy. Ooh, six of pentacles. Got to give you something. Somebody's going to get something. They are. Somebody's about to get something. It's going to it's like this person is going to be giving something that 
They were not giving before. It's going to make you very happy. You're going to feel like you want it, probably. You're going to want it. By the looks of things, okay, this is something that you may you may think you may think that it leads to a commitment or something, but or at least but I'm not sure that it does. This is this is a poor judgment call, and we're talking about what's to come. It may not be a good time, or maybe it wasn't a good time, and this is bad timing. This is coming out of the darkness, coming out of the fear, you know. There's been a lack of communication, a lack of clarity. This person had a lot of fear. But here they come. Here they come really, really, really fast. They are going to be giving something. Very generous. This is very generous. It's a generous offer. They're coming in with a generous offer. They may even invite you out or invite you over or invite you somewhere or something like this. This is definitely somebody that you know. Now, another thing that we need to talk about for these newbies is when I say somebody from the past, it doesn't mean that it is the person that uh, broke your heart. It could be anybody. You think about the, all the people in your past. I mean, how many people did you go to school with? How many people did you grow up with? It, I mean, this is somebody that you have known in the past. It doesn't mean that you've slept with them. Anyhow, there is somebody that you know that is coming in really, 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 really fast. And you are going to be very, very, very tempted to uh, give them a chance, I think. And, um, mm hmm. Nine of Wands reverse. There's extreme fear here. There is extreme fear, but this is uh, stepping out of the fear. This is great personal fear, a need to be gentle. There's some sort of hard feelings here as well. This person has been trying to avoid challenge, but now they're ready to give. They're ready to give something. They're ready to work together. we got three pentacles here now. This person is ready to work together. They're going to be communicating. There's communication coming in from this person. Oh my God, the chariot. So this is replacing that fear with faith, letting go of the fear, finding the mental strength, finding the courage, uh, letting go of not, not letting the emotions get the best of them. That is mastering emotions and taking that journey, going for a ride. They may take you for a ride. They may ask you if you want to go for a ride or something like that. This is somebody that is definitely moving very fast. They are letting go of their fear. They're taking a journey. They've been hiding behind a mask, and that mask was fear. Okay? Now they are controlling their emotions, and they're ready to move forward. So somebody is coming in very, very fast, um, taking a ride. And they're going to, it's like they're going to, they're going to be, they may, they may, you know, they, they're being very generous. Okay? They're being very generous. They, they want to take you somewhere. Somebody is definitely going for a ride. Get prepared to hear or receive some sort of communication from somebody that you knew at one time. This person is attracted to you. Okay, there's some sort of attraction here with that devil card. Okay, there's a deep attraction of some sort. And you may say, why? That's why this can, why, 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 where, why are you here now? You know what I mean? Or, or you may think that because this is thinking, even though it's reversed. You may think, why is, what, what is this person's motives? I feel like this person, um, what are this person's motives? What are this person's motives? Ah, son, they're looking for happiness. This person is looking for growth. They may be looking for a new relationship. They're looking for a new beginning. This person is looking for a new beginning. They're looking for happiness. They may have been in a... That fear had taken over, obviously. Okay? okay? 
So I feel like we have somebody here that is uh, being very genuine. They may be asking for another chance. It may have been bad timing before. Maybe they were struggling financially or something like that. Or they weren't seeing clearly or they just weren't ready because of their great personal fear. Very distrustful. They were probably stomped on by somebody that didn't reciprocate, whatever. You know, and they were still hanging on to the past. They were still clinging to the past. And anyhow, um, this person is about to come in. They're about to, you know, get a, like a kick in the pants. It's like... Uh, all of a sudden, I feel like it's all of a sudden this person kicks it into high gear. Okay? And they decide to make a move and they start and they want it. They want to go someplace. They're, they, this is like a ride. Somebody's going to be taking a ride. Okay? They're going to be taking a ride. And they may be going somewhere like, I don't know, this is getting. Mm, feels like there's some sort of gathering or get together or something. Oh, this person is very abundant. Uh, this is a, this is a wish fulfillment. This is, uh, looking this person, whoever this person is that is coming in does want a relationship because the next card is the 10 of cups. This person is looking for a relationship. So, or if you are in a coupled relationship right now, your relationship may be stepping it up to the next level. Level. This is a breakthrough. This is a new beginning. This is happiness, extreme happiness. This is being accepted, hoping, and this is losing hope. This is this is somebody that was feeling hopeless, but this is being accepted. Okay, so this is you will be. This is being accepted. So this is where you will be accepted. This is a new beginning. It's a new day. It's a new start where you can just be yourself. This is a blessing. So anyway, I feel as though the, you are going to be receiving an opportunity or a call or a message from somebody that wants to take you for a ride. Whatever that means. And it's gonna be it's gonna it's gonna be it's gonna be fun. Okay, it's gonna be happy, it's gonna be a good time. It does look like it's gonna be a good time. Um there's been a lack of communication though. Um Could be dealing with a Cancer. Could be dealing with a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Could be dealing with a Cancer. Did I said that already. Um, could be dealing with a Capricorn. Um, Aquarius. Either way, this is somebody that is replacing fear with faith, and they're getting in the driver's seat, and they're going for a ride. That's what I got. So they're gonna be, and they're, they're gonna be given instead of not giving. They're gonna give. They're gonna put in effort and they're gonna give. So you may you're, whatever they're giving you. Uh, it's real, okay? It's real. It's genuine. It's uh, this person sees an opportunity for happiness and wish fulfillment. So that's what they're looking for. They do. They see an opportunity for happiness and wish fulfillment. You know, it could. It could lead to to a commitment. It could lead to a commitment. But this person was so fearful of commitment. They were very, very fearful. So anyhow, um, things are going to happen fast. Okay? With that Knight of Swords, that is very fast. This person wants to be ahead of the rest. They do. They want to be the winner. Okay? They do. They want this. They do. So this person definitely wants to be the winner. Okay? Um, 
here he comes. Whoever this person is, they're coming in fast, and there ain't no stopping this person, and, and they're they're on a mission. They got something to say, and they're, I think they want to, just, like, it's still almost like, get on. I don't know what that means, but let's go. Good luck. 